Hey guys, and welcome to day 17 of Vlogmas. I look a mess, but I mean, I always do, so it doesn't matter. So today, me and Dad are going to be making uh, Maids of Honor tarts. So it's another cooking video with Emma. You know how well these turn out. Basically, we've been watching uh, Royal Recipes on the TV. I don't know if you guys have been seeing it, but I'm obsessed with like history and especially the Tudor period. And each episode, I think there was 13 or 14 this season, we said yes or no to recipes that we wanted to do. And out of the whole season, we only actually chose one recipe, which is the Maids of Honor Tarts. Now, these, um, I'll read you the synopsis from the website. It says, these traditional English tarts are made from puff pastry filled with almond flavored curd, cheese, and are said to date from the time of King Henry VIII. They are quick as anything to prepare. Well, we'll see in a minute, won't we? So uh, it's, a, it's a Tudor recipe. Um, I've done a few Tudor recipes in the past, but I don't know if I've ever vlogged about them. These Maids of Honor tarts, uh, Anne Boleyn is said to have given Henry VIII one, which is what piqued his interest in her, if I've got my history right. I don't know how accurate that is, but that's the story. So we're gonna attempt to make them. So I'll show you all the ingredients that we've, that we've got, and then, uh, Let's make them together. So here are all the ingredients. So we have plain flour, uh, ground almonds, caster sugar. We have cottage cheese. The recipe actually says curd cheese, but um, Dad spoke to a butcher's and he said that cottage cheese will do the trick because we couldn't find any curd cheese. Then we have an egg, uh, butter, which needs to be softened, some nutmeg. It says on the recipe you can use nutmeg or ground mace. So, caster sugar, I don't know if I've shown that. Puff pastry, because obviously uh, I'm not going to make my own, am I? So we've packet bought it. And we've got some lemon juice. Again, the recipe says that you need lemon zest, but we'll just roll with it and see what happens. So this is all the ingredients. Here we go. And this is a picture from the internet that I put on my Instagram a while ago of what the Maids of Honor tarts are supposed to look like after they're done. So we'll see if ours look anything like this. So first of all, you've got to preheat the oven to gas mark four, which is what we've done. We're just looking for a cake tin. We've preheated the oven. Now the first thing to do is roll this pastry out. So we've got to flour the side. Roll this pastry out and it says slightly thinner than a one pound coin. Then we need to stamp out 12 rounds and line the cake tin with them. Just me to mess it up. What a show was then? <laughs> I don't think I was strong enough. Look how perfect that one was. Mine was better than yours, Dad. Would you like to have a little comparison? <laughs> so we're now obviously putting them into the cake tin, which has been buttered, and then they have to go in the fridge while we make the filling. Um, so they'll just stay chilled in the fridge until we've done the filling. Obviously I did this all by myself, as you can see. Okay, so we now have our caster sugar and our softened butter and we've got to cream these two together in a bowl uh, until pale and fluffy. So that's what we're going to do now. You want to put them in the bowl, Dad? Now you carefully crack your egg, making sure not to get any eggshell in it like I did. <laughs> oh, me and cracking it. I think the last cooking video I did, I crack the egg badly. Oh dear. Now you carefully beat in your beat your egg in the mixture. Yeah, well you have to beat the egg first. Then we're putting the uh, al ground almonds in. Tip them. And then we've got to stir this. Okay, the nutmegs in. Up. So we've just added the cottage cheese which stinks. Right, so I don't know if I'm even going to like this. Any, Mummy's going to now show gently. us how to spoon it in gently. Fold it like that. So it's gentle, so it doesn't split the mixture. Okay, 
so the tarts are in now uh, and it says they take 25 minutes to bake so I'll see you guys in 25 minutes I'm not gonna make you wait the whole 25 minutes on camera and we'll see if they actually turn out all right fingers crossed Okay, so here's what they look like. We've just um, dusted them with some caster sugar as well. The other picture, they are slightly browner in the other picture, but oh well, we'll just we'll just go with it. So they don't smell that bad. They, they, look they smell, okay. they look and smell okay, but it's the cottage cheese that's putting us all off because none of us like it. So <laughs> I'm gonna taste one, and we'll let you know what we think. But these are our maids of honor tarts. So we're all here, me, mum, and dad. We've all got our. Um, maids of Honor tarts. I'm gonna give it a go. Oh, I'm really scared. At the same time, everyone. Ready? Right. You are joking. Yeah, we're Three, all two, one. Oh, oh, oh. Mum don't like it. I'm not sure I need a second bite. What do you think, Dad? Okay. They're disgusting. Let me have a second bite. I like them. I actually like them, yeah. Give me a bar of chocolate. I like them, yeah. So, thanks for watching us make um, Tudor Maids of Honor tarts. Tudor people. As you can see, Mum doesn't like them, but me and Dad do. I think they're all right. I'll see you tomorrow with, I think, day 18. Yeah, day 18 of Vlogmas. Bye-bye.